So the A's have first and third after the stolen base. And here's Aledmus Diaz, who homered twice on Saturday. Shoots it toward right, Drew Waters raises in, dives forward, lays out and makes the catch. He saves a run. His second terrific grab in the inning. The Royals take a 1-0 lead in the top of the second. Jordan trying to snap an 0 for 11. I think get this bat hot again. And a fly ball to deep left. Melendez back at the wall and onto the ledge and gone for Jordan Diaz. Is one, Royals one in the bottom of the second. Taylor moves up to third base. Now the infield goes back for Bobby Wood Jr. Poked into right, coming on, Brown leads, and he got it! So after Drew Waters keeps the A's off the board with a couple of good plays in right field in the first, Seth Brown returns the favor here in the third inning as Blackburn gets out of it. And Zach Geloff leads off for the Athletics. Yellow with a long drive, right center field, back is Isbell, 2-1 Oakland, a bomb from Geloff. I tell you, Vinny, this man has bad intentions every time he steps to the plate, and that home run makes Zach Geloff, that ninth homer in his 32nd career game, the quickest a player has reached nine home runs in athletics history. Geloff was the one that hit the homer off of Marsh in the third inning. Pull it up third baseline. Diving stop. Garcia gets up, fires to first. He got him. What a play by Michael Garcia diving to his right. If he doesn't get to that ball, it's extra bases for Geloff. Instead, it's out number one. First and third, two to one A's. That'll bring up Seth Brown. Brown hits a line drive, left center, base hit, and the A's take a three to one lead. Noda can walk home. Seth Brown delivers the RBI base hit to left center, and the A's lead by two in the fifth. And here's Bobby in his 820 OPS. 0 for 2 tonight. He was robbed of a hit on a diving play by Seth Brown back in the third inning. Bobby hits it to deep center field. Back goes Butler. He turns and it's gone. And holy Toledo. Right off the Bill King sign and straightaway center field. Home run number 25. And it's a 3 2 game. Now Langelier is trying to get something going. He's 0 for 2 tonight. And I think he just did. My goodness. He crushed that ball. That was long and loud. Oh, my. A tidy 456. And the Royals are within one. Now trailing four to three in the top of the eighth inning. The base hit, though, would tie the game with Isbell's speed at second. Massey flicks it, shallow right center field, and it drops for a base hit. Isbell rounds third. He's in to score standing. Michael Massey delivers a game-tying RBI single. Winning run on base in this bottom of the ninth inning, and Rooker is coming up. Fly ball, left center field, way back. Six to four. You just got to put it in the universe, Vinny. Fourth home run tonight for the A's. It's number 21 for Rook. And the A's win the opener of this series against Kansas City.